It's round two of our double feature, ladies and gentlemen, introducing the one, the only Amir of Appetite, Caliph of Cuisine, the Sultan of Snack. Subscribe if you haven't yet. I went to Arby's today. I'm going to be trying out the fried mac and cheese bites. Got about six, five of them in here. Five mac and cheese bites for about four bucks. Haven't tried these yet. I'm a fan of mac and cheese. I'm a fan of fried mac and cheese bites. Burger King, bring back the mac and Cheetos. Bring back, better yet, the flaming hot mac and Cheetos. Arby's, little fried mac and cheese bites. I'm gonna give them a shot and let you guys know what I think. Here we go. Okay. Right off the cuff, right off the bat. Y'all see that? Okay, they dropped them fresh. I think that's what I was waiting on. Crunchy on the outside. Cheesy on the inside. I think this is why fast food exists in, um, in our modern day and age. Stuff like this. Novelty items like this. I mean, in addition to, you know, burgers and fries and whatnot, this is the venue if it's not the fair for stuff like these fried mac and cheese bites where, you know, I know what I'm getting myself into. And the mac and cheese on the inside isn't bad for a fast food restaurant. So definitely, as advertised, deep fried, crunchy balls of cheese, of mac and cheese. Um, these are pretty good overall. Um, if you like mac and cheese, I would definitely head to Arby's and give these a shot. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. If you like what you see, please like, comment, share, and hit that subscribe button. Help a brother out. And as always, spread the good word. This is Snack and Sultan signing off until next time. Thanks, y'all.